Dutch MEP Dirk Jan Epink hit out at the European Parliament as he branded it, boring, without former MEP Nigel Farage. In the Conservative Party, an understatement is an expression of survival, since your opponent within is never far away, basically behind you. However, that party also produced historical leaders like Winston Churchill and Margaret Thatcher, with the power of strong personalities. Since the British have left, the European Parliament has become more boring, if I may say. And without Nigel Farage over there in the corner, rather quiet, like a provincial assembly. But Mr Farage has found other topics to play the naughty boy of Britain. Without the British, the right to dissent seems to disappear from this parliament, unfortunately. There is a, there is a mounting pressure for la pensée unique. Open debates and conflicting arguments, however, are ways to test ideas to reality. Too many narratives in this chamber remain in a void of self-complacency, missing the much-needed reality check. Without the British, the European Parliament tends to become a kind of religious congregation, mainly convinced of itself. We have to look for ways to keep the, these qualities the British have brought to this Parliament, in which, ironically, English remains the main language of communication without interpretation. The Brexit negotiations have also shown cultural differences. The French always have une logique and a big design. The British rather proceed case by case, picking the cases that serve them best, as Mr Barnier may have noticed.